Hi friends, welcome to testing tutorials point. This is Lokesh and today we are going to discussing about a prompt window. How we can able to handle. In this my previous video, we discussed about how to handle alert windows. Right, there are two types of windows we handled. One is OK button and another one is confirmation and cancel button. Once you confirm the confirmation and we are verified the value and we are verified the same thing when we are do it for cancellation how we can able to do the cancellation because javascript is default uh, alert window equal to true then anything if it is open any alert it will by default it will click for ok then we are interrupted to force to stop the clicking for ok then we click for cancellation and we verify the value in an error message place right this is a one kind of flow we done and how we can able to do a prompt type for window a prompt type is nothing but when you click this particular one if you provide something and if you click ok then it will display something value here this is called as a prompt window handles okay how we can able to do this kind of prompt window handles using our cypress means we'll create for one sample uh, test case prompt window dot cy dot js okay and I'm going to create for describe describes and I'm going to create for the title of that prompt window creating the function and uh, creating the test case in this test case I'm going to provide a window prompt Now creating the function then we need to visit for our cypress url then here we need to do for some operation see uh, if we invoke click method for to identify this particular button and we are identify and then we need to go and click that button and get it pop up is very easy we can able to click and we can able to write it but here small problem is there what type of problem is there means because our javascript whenever you click this button if you click like ok button it is immediately it will invoke even it will not allow you to enter something value there and click ok button or cancel button because it is default a javascript having dom having a true alert pop-ups right then even we cannot see that whether it is opened or not also then how we can able to do it means we have there is an option when you see in my previous videos like uh, futures uh, video may in that i told you there is a stub and time clocks right and that particular location you can able to see there are stubs presented that stub we are going to stub is nothing but a prompt window handle we are going to invoke in this stub and doing for our operation okay now I'm going to use for cy dot window okay in this window I'm going to use for then concept and here I'm going to create for one function enable to work with the subject L from the previous command means one particular previous command which is opened that particular window it will open a work function and function returns some value to store then I'm going to create a P and then using here 
and we need to create a stub what type of stub it is present here means we can able to see STV enables you to work with the subject held from the previous command which is the previous command held command is present here that related one it will take it okay sorry a function we directly we wrote on right we can see here once you mouse over and you can able to see example also it will show you stubs spips and clocks okay it will expect some value to validate okay then we are going to use it for there is a pp is a indication for the value which we are going to do where we are going to do there is a prompt window this is called as a prompt window this prompt window handle purpose this stub we are invoking okay what type of value we are going to pass this is a like one type of x path type and which is the one we passed and it will take some return values returns value which is the return value are passed those things it will take i'm going to use for cs technologies okay this is my return type then i'm going to use it to click for my button which is the button this button i used to create for is the nth one child cy dot get and i'm going to use it for my expand that contains what type of value we are going to provide this css technology okay and i'm going to click this one and i enter the value and clicked okay then you can able to see your entered css technologies taking the value and pasting here oh sorry uh, this is the like button right we should not verify here click button we click the button then we need to verify this particular error message for this we need to inspect for element for this is the result it is presented then we can able to use to verify that gate and the single quotation i'm going to use it for my id dot we can able to say contains and which is the value it is presented you can able to take this value paste it and save now we need to open for our box cypress one intend uh, and the chrome then here is prompt window handle now you can able to see it is launching the browser and it will enter some value and you can see here you enter cs technology but it is not showing the pop up because it is added for back end and it is enter and even you can able to see the value is verified here okay there is a one kind of option to verify okay this is all about for verifying the value into prompt okay prompt window by using cypress i hope you understand this video please like me please subscribe my youtube channel and don't forget to share your friends and colleagues thank you